everyone welcome to my channel indian school of physics guys this is nitin here and today i have come with another problem from uh, friction it is based on uh, time varying friction so here is the problem statement in the diagram shown the mass of uh, the man plus block uh, a is 10 kg and of uh, the block b is 5 kg the coefficient of friction under both the blocks is 0.3 the man is firmly fixed standing on the block at uh, block a at t equal to 0 the man start applying force of f on the string which increases according to the relation f equal to kt where k is a positive constant and t denotes time all pulleys are massless and frictionless and the string is massless and inextensible find out the variation of friction forces fra and frb acting on the block a and b respectively as a function of time and also draw the graph of friction force versus time for the <coughs> fra and frb and we will do uh, the tension the string also as a function of time so let's start uh, here we can see uh, that as this man is uh, applying force of f is equal to kt so tension on acting on this is going to be kt here right and uh, let's call this friction as f1 and this friction as f2 so we can say maximum value of friction f1 and maximum value of friction uh, we already know that is 15 newton and uh, 30 newton here so but this force is kt so we can see till the moment till the moment this block moves this tension will never come into picture so first it has to be the friction which will generate right in these problems students normally have a lot of confusion that whether tension will develop first or friction will develop first so tension will come into picture only if uh, this block moves and this will move only if a friction uh, this applied force is exceeding the friction then only this uh, tension t will develop in this case right so first friction is coming so uh, 0 to 15 seconds we can say because this maximum value is 15 and this is kt so 15 by k time this uh, block will be at rest and uh, friction f1 is going to be kt <coughs> so this is what i have written here uh, that tension d1 will develop when the applied force exceed max value of uh, friction right so friction f1 is kt for this much time when kt is less than or equal to 15 or this time interval where t is less than or equal to 15 by k and at that moment another friction here you can see if you balance these forces here this t1 uh, uh, because here uh, this tension is not existing so only this part if you see these two are together and if this is kt this friction also must be equal to kt and this t1 is not existing 0 to 15 by k time so directly we can say f1 is kt f2 is also kt and tension in the string outer string is going to be zero all right now for t greater than 15 by k uh, here it has to be by k <coughs> i'm talking about uh, this time interval all right so at this moment this friction has reached a maximum value you can see this has a, a, a reached the maximum value and difference of these two will give us uh, the tension t so tension t in the outer string will be kt minus 15 right so whatever extra force is there it will pass to the string attached now for man plus block uh, system if you see because that string will come back and it will be acting here so this is ts and this is kt and the remaining friction f2 we can apply in this direction so you can see here if the system is at rest here kt is equal to ts plus f2 kt is equal to ts plus f2 but if i substitute the value of uh, tension t which is kt minus 15 which is kt minus 15 if i substitute here i am going to get this f2 is equal to 15 i am going to get this f2 equal to 15 that means this fric uh, friction value which is uh, maximum up to 30 newton but it cannot exceed in this situation more than uh, 15 it becomes constant because whatever extra force due to kt it is uh, increased that is passing over to the same system uh, with the help of the string and that's the reason after f2 after reaching 15 uh, will become constant and it will be uh, 15 so now we can plot the graph it's very easy f1 f2 graphs will be identical this is kt and this is the moment of 15 by k beyond that both the friction values will become uh, constant and will be having the value of 15 newton whereas tension in the string in the beginning it will be zero up till 
15 by k and after that kt minus 15 will be this uh, will be the value of this tension in the string and it will keep on increasing this is going to be the graph of these two and there can be some nice problem based on the area under the uh, curve and the, maybe they can give this information in this problem and they can ask you this area right so that will look like a different problem but idea is the uh, same in this in these graphs they can ask anything so i hope uh, guys this is clear to you it's a nice problem quite close to me i'll be discussing most of the time with the, the students and they struggle too so if uh, this video is uh, <coughs> you have understood please leave a like share this video with others and uh, if you haven't subscribed to the channel you can subs uh, subscribe also and guys there is another information here related to uh, you can uh, unacademy t20 championship uh, test series you can uh, see it is like rapid fire round and those who it is beneficial for those who want to increase their speed it's like uh, 30 questions and 20 minutes so whenever you are free and if you can devote that much time you can uh, definitely try this and it's absolutely free and uh, if you want you can use the in invite code nathan sir wherever it is asking uh, for some passcode or invite code on the unacademy website you can use this and similarly here there is a seminar uh, or you can say counseling session with the toppers and uh, the top educators it is on october 30th 10 am to 1 15 pm all right here also you can enroll for free and you can get the guidance related to your j preparation and uh, wherever it is asking for uh, invite code you can use my code nathan sir so that's it guys i hope uh, this was fruitful video as i said earlier i'll be uh, I'll try to be regular in this uh, channel here onwards. Thank you.